had just pulled up. I'm so excited but so nervous at the same time. I remember when I first bleached my hair blonde, I felt like I was wearing a wig for like the first week and it was so weird. So I put a lot of makeup on to make the transition hopefully a little bit easier. I've just been wanting to dye my hair dark for so long and I always wondered what I would look like with dark hair because I have light eyes and whenever I see anyone else with dark hair I'm just in love with it I just feel like dark hair looks so sleek and just like put together so anyway I'm super excited we're not gonna go too dark like a dark a dark brown that'll fade a little bit so that if I ever want to go blonde again I can and it's not impossible because I'm the type of person where I like to switch it up a lot I never like to be or look the same I guess you could say for um, more than a certain period of time I'm super weird I'm always changing and like evolving and what I like so um, I told her that I definitely want to be able to go back I don't want to be stuck forever just in case I don't like it so yeah let's go in guys I'm so excited nervous too because so many people around me are like are you sure you want to do it I'm like I'm sure but now you're making me unsure so <sighs> Yeah, let's just go do it. color closer to your scalp because your natural is really light yeah um, it is and because your hair was lifted so light previously like your ends mm -hmm. it grabs the color naturally just more because it's lighter gotcha so um, we're gonna even it out now Is this the treatment or is this something else? So um, the treatment is on your like mids to ends right now. Oh, okay. But um, I don't know if you can see, so this part of your hair is kind of still like um, your natural, right? Uh -huh. Which is almost like a blonde. Right. But this is like significantly darker. So yes. now what we're doing is creating like a shadow. Okay. To where your roots will appear darker and this will slightly get lighter. Oh, okay, okay. Sun, you know what I mean? Got it, yes. Love that.
All right, guys, I just left Alexis's and this is the final look. I literally love the color. I wish I didn't go so short, but I just needed a trim so bad. So I was like, might as well just get a fresh trim and just go back to the short side, why not? But I'm so happy with it. I love that I'm now on the dark side. If you need a hairdresser, if you live in the West Covina area or surrounding area, definitely check her out. I will link her Instagram below. If you have any questions about anything that we did here, feel free to let me know. I tried to get the entire process on it and most of the products that we used also, but I can always ask her any questions that you guys might have, any more specific questions. So, so I'm gonna give it a few days so you can see that how the color looks like five to seven days from now because I'm actually going somewhere this weekend. Today's Monday, I'm going somewhere Saturday. So I'm gonna do my entire face and makeup that day, like get ready to go somewhere and probably do a different hairstyle as well. And then I will film uh, that day too so you guys can see kind of how it's faded out after a few days and how it looks styled a different way. So yeah, I will see you guys Saturday when I check back in. All right guys, I'm on day, let's see, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, day four of getting my hair done. So I got it done Monday, today is Friday. It is currently Friday evening. I wasn't even gonna film this, but I figured why not? Excuse how crazy I look. I just got my eyelash extensions put back on and I swear I developed an allergy, but I'm like so hooked on them that I wanna keep them, even if I look high 24 seven. <laughs> so anyway, don't pay attention to that. So this is how my hair is kind of settled. I actually haven't even washed it yet, but you can see in some parts it's still really light. So I'm going to go back to get it dyed again, but obviously you can't go from bleach blonde hair to dark brown hair in one session. So anyway, this is kind of how it's sitting. I obviously have it half up, half down. I just worked out, so it's definitely dirty now. I'm going to wash it for the first time tonight. But I wanted to show you guys what I was gonna do. So my roommate actually told me about this toner for dark hair. I didn't even know they made toners for dark hair. I thought they only had that for like light hair, but obviously I'm mistaken. There's literally a fly and I'm gonna be so annoyed in a second. Okay, so this is what it is. It's Overtone Rich Black Coloring Conditioner. Covers all hair colors. So it's kind of like when you see people who are blonde and then all of a sudden they have like fun pink hair or something. It's because they used a conditioner like this that just leaves it in their hair for a few days and then it just washes right out. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this tonight because I'm doing a few things this weekend and I just want my hair to be dark. So I'm gonna do my best to try to film it. I'm gonna hop in the shower, shampoo my hair, condition my hair normally, and then I'm gonna get out and put this color tone in my hair. So when I do that, I will try my best to film it. And then I'll show you guys tomorrow what it looks like when we're all done. All right guys, I just washed my hair, shampoo and conditioner. Now I'm gonna go in with that conditioner. I hate that I can't like vibe out and have my music in the background or I'll get copyrighted. So I'm not gonna talk the rest of this.
All right guys, so it's been about 10 to 15 minutes. I was spending like three minutes getting the dye off my hands. Side note, make sure you use gloves. I just didn't have any gloves and I was too lazy to try to look for some or get some. So that's why I just used my hands. But unless you want purple hands like me, get some gloves, okay? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it out right now. And then I might show you guys the initial after. I haven't decided yet, stay tuned. Oh, also, by the way, make sure that you wear dark clothes when you do this because you, your hair is probably longer than mine. Um, yeah, because you don't want to get this stuff all over your cute clothes. So that's why I'm wearing all black. Hot tip. Hey, guys. All right, it's finally Saturday. Ooh, this is the first time I'm, like, seeing myself in a camera, and I love my hair. Oh, my God. So this is day four, I believe, and... I toned my hair last night. As you can see, it's still light in some areas. Obviously, you're never going to be able to get it perfect, but I'm going to end the video here, guys. If you have any questions about my hair, the color, the products, whatever, just ask me in the comments below. I'm in love with it. Since I used that darker toning conditioner, I don't even know if I need to go dark anymore because I do really love how it looks today, but um, I hope to see you guys in my next video, and thank you so much for watching.